Well, we're going to make these cookies with a cake mix, a red velvet cake mix. And if you do not want to use a cake mix, my sister has a cooking channel. And she would love for you to come and look at it, and I would too. She has a cooking channel, and I will uh, put it in the description, the, a link to her channel. And she has a recipe for these cookies, but they're made from scratch. And the channel name is Myra's Media. So go ahead and give that a check. See if you like it. Anyway, I'm going to uh, sift my flour. Next we're going to add two eggs. And a third a cup vegetable oil. We need some vanilla. A teaspoon of vanilla. And that's pretty much it. We're going to mix this up. Well, that took about two minutes to mix up. I'm going to add some uh, white chocolate and just stir these in. I'm using a scoop to put the cookies on there. I really never make cookies, so I'm no expert at it. But yay, I'm making them today. So anyway, I'm just going to put six on there. And these are going to go my 350 degree oven. Here they are out of the oven. They bake for 12 minutes. So I'm going to let them cool down for 10 minutes. And then after the 10 minutes, we're going to take them, put them on a, a rack to cool completely. Well, this makes two dozen cookies, and I've been eating on them. I've had four of them, and they are really, really good. So you can leave them like that. But some of them come out with less chocolate chips. Well, you could add more chocolate chips. I only added a half a package. Or you could take them and put some cream cheese on there. Not cream cheese. Cream cheese frosting, I mean. Put some of that on there. And sprinkle them with uh, red, red sugar crystals. Now, does that look like Christmas? It does to me. So some of them you could put icing on. Uh, you could leave them the way they are. Just whatever you want to do. And I bet you they're even better with the cream cheese frosting. Yum! I want to thank you so much for watching. 